Here are six common causes of a vitamin K2 deficiency. Okay, number one on my list is insufficient dietary intake. We're simply not eating enough foods that are high in vitamin K2. And it can be very difficult, so especially if you're eating a vegetarian diet or a plant-based diet, to get enough of that vitamin K2. And if you eat a standard American diet or North American diet, we don't eat a lot of fermented soy products as they do in other parts of the world where they naturally are gonna get some of that K2 in their diet. Okay, number two, another cause for low K2 is poor absorption. So as we age, unfortunately, our absorption and our digestive enzymes decrease. And if we're not absorbing our K2 appropriately, even if we're getting a little bit in our diet, that can lead to a deficiency in vitamin K2. Okay, number three on my list is disruptions in the gut bacteria. So when your microbiome isn't healthy, maybe you've got too many of the bad guys and the less favorable organisms and not enough of your good guys, your probiotics, this can really affect your proper absorption of your vitamin K2. Okay, number four is if you have poor liver and gallbladder function, this will affect your inability to properly absorb vitamin K2, which is fat soluble. So it is a fat soluble vitamin, much like vitamin D, vitamin E, vitamin A, all fat soluble vitamins. So making sure that your liver and gallbladder are optimally functioning is going to be really important for that proper K2 distribution and absorption. Okay, and number five, on my list, another common cause of vitamin K2 deficiency is the use of antibiotics. Now I know that we often do need antibiotics, however, it can disrupt our proper absorption of that vitamin K2. And number six on my list is certain other medications can also cause a vitamin K2 deficiency. And this could be your acid reflux medication, it could be anti-seizure medication as well, and certain treatments for different disease processes can also decrease that proper absorption of your vitamin K2. Now, do you take vitamin K2? Let me know in the comments. And I've got other videos on, you know, certain combinations that you shouldn't take your K2 with. But I also want to talk a little bit more, and I want you to check out this video about leaky gut. And I've got tips there how to fix your leaky gut. Five tips to fix leaky gut. I'll see you there.